So after a long day of training or coaching, it's not a bad idea. In fact, sometimes before a long day of training and coaching, it's not a bad idea. Kidding to make yourself a martini. And I like to think of a martini as a metaphor for the kind of work I do in training and consulting because it brings together extraordinary ingredients and mixes them all up in a lovely frothy mixture that delights people. So that's what we're trying to do when we're working together in teams or building functional staff groups or volunteer and staff groups that can get together and mix it up and produce a fabulous result. So, where you start, of course, with a great vodka martini. And I'm afraid, gin people, this is going to leave you out, but just substitute gin every time I say vodka. We start with a very good vodka. And my favorite is Grey Goose. People have their various favorites, but my particular favorite at the moment is Grey Goose, which comes from France and is always kept in the freezer. You must keep it in the freezer. Et voila. From France. Grey Goose. Then, you have vermouth. Now, I've had this vermouth for about a hundred years because you, l you literally use, well, as you'll see, so little that it doesn't really matter, but you need it around just to believe that it helped to enhance the flavor. So, you take your vodka martini makings. Ah, what a sound. Grey Goose. You take your shaker, which, don't you love this? This is sort of a Art Deco shaker ice and you can use your hands because it's vodka right so it's pretty sterile so here we go we put a lot of ice in the shaker a lot of ice in the shaker and for those of you who are into the stirred martini get over it um, I'm gonna shake okay so now what we do is we put plenty of vodka in here that's yeah a little more plenty of vodka and then we take Maybe a drop. Oh, there it is. See this? It will be hard to see on camera, but there we go. Oh, that's probably too much, but there were about four drops that went in there. And there we are. That's all. We, so you can see why this lasts forever. All right. Now the activity. We shake it up. So bringing all these brilliant ingredients together, ice, wonderful vodka, and three drops of vermouth and we're about to place it in these lovely glasses but before we do that we need a hint of lemon and so we have our lovely peeler here which will give us a nice little oh look at that zest flying off oh fantastic little twist and another little twist Again, oh, yeah, I wish you could smell this. I wish we had smell -o video. There we go. Now, oh, extraordinary. And one more. Whoa. You see why I poured a lot of vodka? These are big glasses. And there we are. Cheers to a great day of training.